A former ambassador to Denmark is one of two Republican women seeking the nomination for U.S. Senate from Pennsylvania. As political editor John Delano reports, Carla Sands is joining a crowded field that wants to move in when Pat Toomey retires. At last count, there are 13 Republican candidates for Senate. Two women, both of whom make the pundits list of top five because of their wealth or name recognition. Ambassador Carla Sands is one of them. Meet Carla Sands, former President Trump's ambassador to Denmark. I am a pro-life, pro-First and Second Amendment, constitutional conservative woman, and I grew up in Cumberland County in the middle of our great Commonwealth. I attended Indiana University of Pennsylvania and Elizabethtown College. I became the third uh, in my family, the third generation doctor of chiropractic and practiced alongside my father in our hometown clinic in Camp Hill. Besides being a chiropractor, Sands had a brief acting career in the 1980s, appearing in film and CBS's The Bold and the Beautiful, before marrying Fred Sands, a very successful real estate capitalist in California. When he died in 2015, she became CEO of the Vintage Capital Group, donating money to the Trump campaign and the Republican Party. There's nobody else in this race that I have seen year after year, decade after decade, contributing five and six figures every year to the RNC, the Republican National Committee. Having lived in California at least half her life, her opponents level the same charge against her as they do against Dave McCormick, who moved back here from Connecticut, and Mehmet Oz, who moved into the state from New Jersey. Did you move back to Pennsylvania just to run for the U.S. Senate? It's a fair question, John. My Pennsylvania ancestors fought in the American Revolution. They fought in the Civil War. I have deep roots in Pennsylvania. This is my time to fight to save our country. Sounding a lot like the president she worked for, Sam says this is a battle to stop what she calls left-wing radical Democrats who have taken over the country. We are going to take our country back restore rule of law, secure our border, grow our energy, protect our farmers, make sure our kids get educated, not indoctrinated, and kill this Biden inflation. That is my goal. Sands has stiff competition for the Republican nomination from fellow Republicans, Kathy Barnett, Jeff Bardos, Dave McCormick, and Mehmet Oz. But she fully embraces President Trump, including his claims about a stolen election and hopes for his endorsement. 